Hey everyone, I'm Steven to 1967 and we are in the infected. And I am working on some smelting tasks. I need to make some more bars. Right now, focusing on iron, I've already done what I can with making smelting uh, cobalt ore into making it into bars. I've also done that with what I had available for aluminum and unfortunately I didn't have any copper because I forgot to get the copper extractor going. So what I want to do is I want to craft a few um, items that I'm going to need coming up winter. Well, maybe not coming up winter, but items I need and want to have done before winter. For example, I want to have uh, I want to have the oven done. I would like to have the refrigerators done, but the problem is I don't have enough power for the refrigerators. And the problem with having power is I need, I think I need more copper to make more of um, the, the solar panels. And unfortunately, those are just, um, as I said, I didn't. Okay, we got too much in there. As I said, we uh, we forgot to turn on the copper extractor up north. So what we have here is I want to get, even though I want to get these both these refrigerators, I want to have two refrigerators. Probably, I probably need three. But what I should be able to do is I should be able to get this going because if I'm right, this does not require any electricity run. So we've got some iron ingots. We have to go get some more, right? Yeah, a couple more. Okay, check those out. Those look like they're done. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Alright. Yeah, we just got, we got a ton of rocks. It's kind of unfortunate that rocks is the only way to get iron because that really slows down anything that we need to make that requires iron. Is before before patch 5.0, you could get iron ingots. I mean, you could get iron um, ore or get iron fragments, and you still kind of can, but it's usually from drops from the infected. And you know, it's a crapshoot whether or not you actually get any, you know, get iron, iron ore or iron ingots or iron fragments. I mean, to drop from the infected and so what we got to do is every time you smelt a rock it turns into uh, an iron fragment so that's good okay so let's take care of that and I think we needed firewood too so let's get over here we think we needed 10 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and we're gonna get we're gonna need to get some fire or we're gonna get some logs to uh, re get the firewood going okay we needed only eight that's good so we're gonna need to create some pans and let's see I am PDF uh, oops food and drinks I think it's, un it's uh, under others okay so we got pan two iron ingots pot is three iron ingots so that shouldn't be too hard and then this um, will require one of those so oops so I'm gonna grab a coal and I'm just gonna throw it in here just to have you know some coal in place there you go now that's ready for its first time through okay just grab all this stuff um, yeah we don't need any more of that I'm just gonna put that in there for right now so yeah we're just going through the boring task of trying to get as much iron as we can um, I do expect that we'll be able to construct some items I think we we might be able to make at least one solar panel if not maybe two I'm trying to remember if we needed four copper or do we need five copper per solar panel and if I can get two more solar panels going then then at least that's something bare nothing right you just make do with with what you've got I have to go out and Go farm some more stones. Oops. Oh, 
we gotta put a rock in there and then I think we need oh uh oh we're out of rocks there put you there get you there get you out and throw you in there I'm gonna go out here for a second get this stuff out of my bag quick look let's see see any rocks yeah oh well no rocks out here so yeah we're not gonna make that we're not gonna make that let's see we can make some more. So we need a ton more iron ingots and I can certainly do that we need planks times 440 and actually we need the ironings we need five iron ingots so we can make a pot and a pan let's see we could do planking here real quick get a bunch of stuff there done get all this just get a couple planks I mean might as well do try to do multiple things so don't need planks for that I wouldn't mind having some more of these I can't think of did I need planks for anything else yeah that needs those need planks and iron ingots I do want to make a bunch of weapons slash tool rack, so we'll just have a few more. I right, need just one more. One more plank for that. Did I grab it? Yeah, I think I grabbed it. Okay. Yeah, the circular saw is great. I mean it takes one it takes one log and turns it into um turns it into four planks as opposed to the saw machine which will take um, does take one uh, log and turns it into only two planks so actually the circular saw is the best bang for the buck okay get get that out of there actually this one yeah that one's still got a lot of fire in it I'm gonna let these go out I'm not gonna worry about them right this second because we have to run out and Okay, we can put that there because that one still has a bit of time. Now I'm going to have to get some more, get some more stones in a moment. I'm going to put that there, get that out of my bag. And let's see. You need a little of that. Yep, definitely some vitamins. A little bit of water. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, we got a bunch of storage. What do we got here? Yep, two fridges, but they're not running. Oh, let's before we do that, let's um placeable power. So it needs iron, aluminum, copper. So four copper. I can get two more going up there. Yeah, one, two, three, four two three four okay that takes care of that nothing else here needs copper right now I think we do need that more upstairs the pots and pans we can do those in a little bit all right I want to check that recipe is it four or is it five oops placeables power let's see uh, five iron five aluminum so let's go get the cobalt let me check I want to see I know I have overage here um, I'm probably overloaded aren't I oops close to it not quite all right oh we don't have oh, we don't have enough let me see oops all right, we can just put that there. There we go. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get it all done at one time here. So take what we've got, bring it up, and get ourselves a couple more, a couple more solar panels upgraded. See, so we want this one. We run down and get the aluminum. All right, we want that one. Okay, we need ten aluminum. Yeah, I know. I probably don't need to close that. I'm going to be right back up. 
I'm just getting the habit of closing doors because the Vambies can now get up on our bases. And if they can get up on our bases, then they are a threat to us. They are a big time threat to us. Oops. I can take that back now. One, two, three, four. Was it five? Then one, two, three, four, five. I think it was five. So maybe by this winter, actually what we can do is we can put this up here. We can jump down and check really quick. Let's take a real quick check here. So we got that. That needed five. Okay, that needed five. Let's see, what was I thinking? Oh yeah, okay, so let's go down. There's no fall damage. Take a look at this. Okay, so this is this is past quarter done. So this is like, we still have a while before we're half done. And it's in May, so my guess is December or something like that this will be completely finished running which means the cobalt extractor and the copper extractor which I started the same day will all be done with their extracting tools so I can go get them so this is not a huge priority uh, I want to make some pans so I can get some food going there let's see you we might as well Put one in there. Get one out. Get one out of there. Put one in here. I might I might move that around, but we're just gonna put that in there to have a place to put it in there. And we need to go get some other stuff done. Alright, so this is gonna be like the boring stuff where I gotta go out and I gotta farm gotta farm stones. And let's see, it takes, yeah. So, yeah, we're gonna farm a bunch of stone. So anyway, I don't know, I'll kinda spare you this part. And we'll come back, I think when we get more done. I have ideas of other things I would like to do in this video. You know, something more than just this. And, uh, okay, I'll bring you back in, in a little bit. Okay, we're back and I was able to make enough iron that I should be able to make pans. Let's see. Workbench. Okay, so we got to go over the workbench and get this up and running. Let's see. One, two. So we got one pan, another pan. Then a pot. And another pot. And that should be all I need. I'm not going to need multiple ovens at all. Alright, let's get... Let's see, we want... Put a pot there. And a pan there. And then another... Pot there and another pan. There we go. Now we can cook. Um... There's a stew that we can make that adds hit points. You know, it doesn't just recover it doesn't recover hit points. It adds hit points to our to our life. So let's see. It's right here. It's meat stew. And it adds I believe it adds five health per each one of these. And you can eat these without actually needing them. So my understanding is you can eat them, you'll get repaired, your your health will go up five points. You can go up to a maximum of 200 from 100. So that means, what is that? Is that 20? Yeah, I got that right. So if you eat 20 of these, you will be maxed out at 200 hit points. And that's made with this stew. And that's raw. There's uh, raw meat, raw fish, and potato. Even though this doesn't show a potato. It should be like, you have one raw fish, one raw meat. And then there should be, this should be like a potato. But for whatever reason, it's showing. <coughs> it's showing to meet here all right so that that's something we can do um i would like to do a demonstration if i can let me see so i have okay i don't have any fish left in here so we gotta do a little bit of fishing real quick all right come on fishy oh 
and I damaged my spear. So we got two fish. All right, well, that's better than no fish. And I gotta make, let's see, oops. Let's grab a rock, grab one. Oh, I'll grab this one too, and then one more for three. Okay, let's get this crafted. You there, you, and then we need five of you. Okay, now I got my spear back. Let's see, I wonder if there happens to be any animals in inside our fence. Lots of birds, but birds don't give meat. Ooh. I wonder where I got them. I wonder if I just winged them or something. No, I got them in this. I got them in the shoulder. We're not gonna shoot them again, man. We don't have to. If we shoot them again, there's a chance that the arrow is gonna go flying, and we're gonna miss, and then we're gonna be down another arrow. And they're not like that expensive to make, but it's annoying. Okay. Take a look. See what we can find. Again, birds don't give us meat. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I'm just looking to double check something. So we're going to need some potatoes. And I'm going to grab that corn anyway. And I heard a wolf. And if I... I can't think of a better reason... Right. Okay, what did it give me six of? Stone arrows. It gave me six stone arrows. Nice. How very kind of him. So we do have we do have enough. That we can do that. What else? Let's see. Food and drinks. Okay, so that's just potatoes. And this is this is cooked. This is cooked in. I think this is cooked in the pan. And not on the pot. But maybe it can be cooked on the pot. Maybe we can do it on the pan and on the pot. Yeah, I don't hear very much going on out here. Oh, got him. Oh, and he got me. Oh, 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 there it is. It's hiding in the ground. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta go make, I gotta do some repairs. So I'm gonna have to get the repair tool. See how are we doing. We took a little damage. Do a little numbing. That'll be okay. Yeah, I think that okay. So we got, we got one of these. So, get there, get there, there, there. And now we're just gonna grab one potato from our garden. Do I have room for that? Do I have room for that? Yeah, I got room for that. Alright, um... We get one potato going here. That's good news. And now we'll just craft it and throw it on the pan here. Oh, 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 workbench. It seems, wait, Shouldn't this be done on the food prep table? Used to be you could do it on the crafting table. Yeah. Yep, there it is. There it is. Little by little I'll realize where all these things are. Okay, stew mix. That's one. That's two. And three. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. We put it here. 
That can go there. Okay, it can't be put there. Alright. Alright, we can just get that going. Okay, there we go. Now we can see that. You see that running. We'll get this done, and then I'm going to... I'll go ahead. I'm going to eat two of them. So I'll eat one, and you'll see my health will be 100%, or it should be 100%, plus 5. So it'll be 105. So I'm at 96. When I eat this, this should get me to 105 health, if I'm correct. And then I can eat the other one, and that one will get me to 110 health, even though I will be at full health. I believe that's how it's going to work. And then we can put this one in there and have that one too if we want. Advanced foods on the stove. Alright, look at that. Got a meat stew, okay. Okay, that gave me, it gave me only one. Okay, it's not five. It doesn't give me, okay, I misread that. It didn't give me five, but it did give me one point. So, if you want to go from 100 to 200, you need to eat about 100 of these in order to do it. Okay, that's how that works. And I think also stamina also went up a little bit. Let's see. I'll just look at that again. It says adds plus one to your max health. And nothing about stamina. So I don't know why the stamina, it's, is it supposed to increase my stamina or not? A little confusing. I've seen people with like 200, you know, 100 health and, I mean 200 health and 200 stamina. I'm not sure exactly how that happens, so let's just eat it. Okay, it doesn't change the stamina. What is it that's changing the stamina? I don't know. Alright, well, anyway. There we go. We went ahead and cooked something. And I'm not... I'm honestly not sure. Have to cook advanced foods. Okay, there's nothing there. No advanced foods there. This, this here. I can't, I can't figure out for the life of me what the advanced food that they're talking about is. It doesn't, it doesn't look like there is a food for the pot. So we kind of have a pot there. Shoot. Okay, so, well, we got that in place. Anyway, we got that done. Um, that'll be it for this video. Uh, it's this is about as much as we're gonna get done. Let's um, we got to go out and farm even more of these. Yeah, it's just I'm not worried about the coal burning itself out without me having anything in there. I'm not gonna you know put water on it to stop it. I I don't care. I've got so much coal, man. I do not know what to do with all of it. I'm fine with wasting it. I know some of you are like, don't waste it. You might need it later. Yeah, you might be right. You know, you, you totally, totally might be right. But I'm just going to, I'll be okay with it. I'll be okay that way. And now I got to figure out where all this stuff needs to be put. Okay, so that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. You know, if you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up, a like. And um, if you hit the notification bell, you will get uh, alerts whenever I come out with my next video. And that's it for this one. And we'll see you in the next video. Later, dudes.